Hi, thanks so much for watching this video. Tim Heaviside, Wendy Joe. we're from Heaviside, we're the estate agents and we're with our client, his name is Jim. You've just sold your apartment here, your penthouse, with Wendy and I and this is a little bit of a chat about the post sale and a bit of a wrap up. Yeah, look, we've had a terrific experience and it, the fact that we've sold it is something that's been incredibly important to us because it looked like through the process of going to two other agents that we were going to be extremely lucky to sell. Whereas with Heaviside, they were with us for three weeks. We had more people through the apartment in those three weeks, far more people than we had in six months with the other two agents. How many buyers came through in total in that amount of time? Well, in that amount of time, probably about 20 and we didn't get one offer. What do you think that would, was different how we approached the sale? Yeah, I mean, rather than being marketed as an apartment 602, it was a penthouse apartment. And no doubt that would have captured a few people. I think the use of the drone photo is really important. The other thing that was really important was the use of social media. But I think Wendy played a huge part in that, in getting in touch with people that were certainly not picked up in the first six months of our experience. Well, I know on the very first day we walked out of the apartment into the foyer and there were 13 groups in the foyer. We just could not believe it. Yeah, right. the, other, the other thing was we had terrific communication between both of you uh, before and after open uh, inspections. What about the, the negotiation um, process we have done to deliver you the offer at the end? Yeah, well it was a really, from our point of view, a tremendous couple of hours. It was obviously done in a very skillful way because we got an end result that we were very pleased with. Jim, in your word, what do you find the difference between us and the previous other agents in dealing with the Chinese buyers? Look, I think there were a couple of things. One is the very fact that you were involved, Wendy. One of the original agents we used had nobody with any Chinese Mandarin background. Mm. And I think that's obviously not the way to do things in Boondara. We had far more people, but we had far more Chinese Australians as well. And the very fact that one of the offers mm. right at the closing part of the sale was from a Chinese Australian, I think perhaps was a reflection of how comfortable they were with the way that the property was being marketed and sold. The, the first offer we got, we actually accepted that offer, or at least verbally, and only to find that Heaviside had actually been talking to another potential buyer. And, and so we had those two in the frame. That was reflective of the final outcome, which we were very pleased with and we worked hard on the negotiation and we achieved another 80,000 on top of the first offer. So Jim, would you feel comfortable referring Wendy, myself and our team to other family, friends and associates? I'm certainly very comfortable, I've already done it. <laughs> Jim, really appreciate you being here today um, with Wendy, um, your wife Kay. We're, we're our part of our um, I guess motto at our agency is inspiring your next chapter in real estate. I know this this property has been part of your your history and your chapter in life, um, and you're moving to the, your next chapter. But it's been a real privilege and honour for Wendy and I to represent yourself and Kay in the sale. We really appreciate. It. Thanks so much. Terrific. Thanks, Tim. And thanks, thank, thank you, Wendy.